So you might be trying to figure out how you can delete and or remove applications and or games from your iCloud account or from your iCloud you know, backup within your you know, memory that you have inside your iCloud account. Now, doing this is actually very, very basic and it really doesn't take too much time at all. So the very first thing you're going to want to do is you want to hop inside of your settings application of your iPhone, your Mac, your iPad, whatever you have, and you want to go and tap on your name, which is right here. So tap on your name and it's going to bring you into this panel. Now, what you're going to want to do here is right here where it says iCloud. What you're going to want to do is tap on iCloud and this little panel is going to come up. At the very bottom, you'll see a bunch of other random information. But the very top right here, you'll basically see this thing that comes up that says you know, how much storage you have and then manage account storage. So what you're going to want to do here is you want to go and click on manage account storage right there. And this next panel is going to come up. Now, this is where you can go and edit up all the things that you want to go and basically edit up. So if you look at the bottom here, you'll basically see a lot of other information. You'll see backups, you'll see icon. What you want to keep a note for is basically any games in or applications that you want to go ahead and remove from your storage. So you can see right here, I have GarageBand. It's taking up 408 kilobytes, so it doesn't even make sense to delete it so small. But what I can do is I can tap on it, and it's going to go ahead and get me into here. And what I can do is I can delete this specific application data from my iCloud account. So now I can just click on delete, and it's going to remove from iCloud right down there. And you can see I can remove app data, and it's going to save me this amount of storage. Now for this app, it's not going to be that big of a deal, but you can see that if I actually were to remove some of these bigger ones, this five gigabytes that I have will actually end up saving up, and I can probably get up to like, like well, at least a couple gigabytes just by deleting some stuff randomly from here. So that is basically how it's done. It's a super basic process. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.